Working to learn more this afternoon after a rollover crash involving a semi shut down lanes of I-70 for hours earlier today. Three people died. Two others were hurt when a semi hauling pipes rolled, sending that load over the median and into oncoming traffic. It happened in the eastbound lanes of I-70 near Ward Road in Weed Ridge just before 830 this morning. Now eastbound lanes still closed. Westbound just reopened a few minutes ago. Your reporter in Jefferson County, Andrew Hobner, joins us live now. Andrew, terrible news about this, and we know this cleanup, something this big, certainly takes a lot of time. Yeah, an extremely tragic situation and one that has caused significant delays, not just for the morning commute, but now for the evening commute as well. Around 2 o'clock this afternoon, you finally started to see some movement. The semi that had rolled over was rolled back onto its normal wheels and then taken off by tow truck. But afterwards, the damage had clearly been done. Three people are dead, two injured. They came all out of one vehicle. The driver also was injured, but he is in stable condition. Now, the investigation has already begun into how the semi rolled over and how the crash began, but there's been concerns from multiple residents as well as commuters through this area about just how dangerous this particular portion of I-70 is given the amount of construction that is currently being done that creates uneven surfaces as well as sharp turns. And those residents say that this is the type of thing that can happen when people aren't paying enough attention. So on top of that, we will also hear from them at five o'clock, not just the members of the Wheat Ridge Police Department with that information, but also from the residents themselves about what they need to see changing here on this roadway. Live in Wheat Ridge, I'm Andrew Hobner covering Colorado First. Yeah, Andrew, we appreciate your reporting. We look forward to hearing more from you coming up. Andrew, your reporter and Jeff Coe.